Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem three in chapter fourteen. Chapter fourteen is about oscillations. In this one, this、uh, we look at this system. This is a car, and this yellow part is a driver. And tell us when the yellow part, yeah,、uh, the driver get in the car will oscillation, right? We need to find this frequency of oscillations. So in this situation, in these systems, ah,、uh, even though it give us a mass for the car, do we consider? No, because you can say in this system we take this car as reference point. Agree? So that means we only need to consider the driver and the spring, right? So this、uh, is not useful. The mass of the car. Now we can see what mass is important. The driver's mass, this one, right? Because it connected with the spring. So now this mass becomes a six six kilogram. Now, what is delta s? The distance it compressed this one it gave us. So we write it there. Now we can see in this equation we can find net force equal to k times delta x. Uh, right? Elastic force equal to k times delta x. Now this、uh, force is just equal to gravity acted by the driver. So mass times、uh, g. And then delta x is given. So in this equation, it uh in this equation very easily we can get function for the k, the oscillation, uh constant of spring. The next one, how can we find frequency? So we learn this equation in our textbook, and、uh, that is easy, right? You just input the k inside, you can get the final answer there. Thank you.